In my video CreateSpace cover template, how to make a book cover with GIMP, I rushed through the process skipping over two very important steps in creating a good paperback book cover. Today I'm going to show you how to make a book cover spine with GIMP. Stay tuned! Welcome to Self Publishing with Dale, and if you're new to this channel and you want to learn how to publish and profit the right way, then subscribe and hit the bell icon next to it to get notifications on all my latest videos. Recently, I had a viewer submit a question on my video about how to make a book cover with GIMP. He asked, where's the spine on the cover? Great question. In this channel, I try to keep my videos brief and to the point so you spend less time watching my videos and more time publishing. That's why asking questions in the comments are so important. Before we go into the book cover spine tutorial, you should know what merits a spinal matter. According to CreateSpace, for books with 130 pages or less, we strongly recommend a blank spine. Blank spines are required for books with less than 101 pages. Don't try to test them on that rule of spinal matter on smaller books. Trust me, I've tried and the cover either comes out wonky or CreateSpace rejects it. A general rule for all print cover matter is to keep all relevant material away from the pink bleed lines. If you don't want to lose it or have it fouled up, then keep it away from the bleed areas. Here's how to make a book cover spine with GIMP. One, select the text tool. Two, type out what you want on your spine. Three, highlight the text and change the font and size in the small bar above your text box. Four, select the layer tab at the top of the window. Five, put your cursor over the transform option in the drop down. Six, select rotate 90 degrees clockwise. 7. Select the Move tool to position your spine matter in between the pink bleed matter on the spine. 8. Select the Alignment tool and click on your spine text layer. 9. Choose both centering tools in the Align menu. 10. If the text doesn't appear, then make sure that layer is on the top in your Layers menu. Simply select a layer and click the green arrow keys up or down in the Layers menu. I read all my comments and do my best to serve you, the viewer, and subscriber. <coughs> Please subscribe. Now what about that pesky back cover anyway? You wouldn't want to leave that naked now, would you? Now get out there and put a spine on that book, you savvy self-publisher, you. Till later, this has been Self-Publishing with Dale, and I'll see you guys soon.